Let's take a look at how you can identify leads to follow up with. So follow up boss is a really powerful tool um, to manage and keep track of all the people that have contacted you. Uh, over time though, you have a lot of people in here and it can be difficult to figure out who you wanna follow up with. So a few quick tips here. Um, you can use these blocks if you mouse over here to actually move the order of these columns or to resize them if that's helpful. Um, but you can also click on these to search by uh, or search or sort by people who meet certain criteria. So for example, uh, this is a great one. Phone number is not empty. If you're going to make your calls, then this is a great feature to help you identify only the people that have phone numbers. Now this is a fake demo account, so these numbers are all fake numbers and the system has figured that out. But that is a great way for you to pull together all the people in your system that have phone numbers. Um, you can also apply multiple um, of those filters. So if you wanted to say, you know, stage includes lead, so people that are stage lead and they have phone numbers, you can drill down to that. So lots of great things you can do with this. You can also um, search or sort by last activity, last communication. So you can either identify people who are um, people you haven't talked to in a long time or people that you may have talked to recently that you should follow up with. Um, just another great feature to identify um, people that um, are the right people for you to follow up with. So created is another great one as far as sorting by older or newer. So you can sort by created being when they first came into the system. So a great way to find your newer leads or to sort um, by oldest to newest and find the oldest leads in the system that maybe haven't been followed up with in a while and just send them a quick um, you know, follow up or ask how they're doing or if they need help with anything.